Thank you so much, Excellency. Um, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a long day, uh, and I decided to, uh, to go with sneakers and a t-shirt, trying to be cool for this closing. There are, thank you. There are days that stay with us, and I think it's fair to say that today is definitely one of those days, at least, at least for me. We came here to accelerate progress on the Sustainable Development Goals, kicking off this morning at 10 a.m. with impassioned pleas by President Kagame, by the DSG, Amina Mohammed, by Dennis Francis, the president of the 78th session of the General Assembly. We raise the voice of the private sector, of innovators, of youth, and they engage with officials at the highest levels of government and the UN system. And looking at them challenge, listen to, and learn from each other, I couldn't help but see the world that Amina Mohammed described as, as a world of hope, uh, really a world of hope and a promise for all that leaves no one behind. Today we showed what data and digital technologies can do when they're harnessed safely and when they're harnessed responsibly. This journey took us many places. It took us from the rainforest. It took us to space. It took us to classrooms in the world's most remotest areas. It has opened a window into solutions that are changing the lives of farmers, of teachers, of judges, of doctors, entrepreneurs, and so many others. We turn to the future with the launch of the SDG Digital Acceleration Agenda, which is a call to action. It's a call to action that contains a roadmap for navigating challenges as diverse and critical as digital skills, governance, regulation, financing, infrastructure, and security. Women and girls and other vulnerable groups were at the top of our priorities. We also launched the UN High Impact Initiative on Digital Public Infrastructure, DPI, together with UNDP, ITU. And Administrator Akim Steiner described DPI as the new roads and bridges of the future where countries can transport digital benefits to communities. And I'm so grateful to Akim and the UNDP team for their collaboration and for believing in SDG Digital. ITU and UNDP have embarked on many important projects together, and I'm inspired by the strength of this partnership. These are some of the things that we did today, and of course, none of this would be possible without all of you. Uh, so ladies and gentlemen, let me thank you for being with us all day. Thank you to our speakers, to our brilliant moderator, to Femi. Uh, and there are too many really to thank and mention here, but our, our um, SDG uh, Digital Day Advisory Board uh, and our other partners, really thank you. And I just want you to know that you've given us what you've given us is going to ripple far beyond the walls of this conference room. Thank you also to those that made further pledges on Partner to Connect. It, it brings us really one step closer to our goal of meaningful connectivity and digital transformation for all. Thank you again, Femi. Thank you, Sinead. And really a, a, a big thank you to all of you for being here throughout the day as we set out on this decisive high-level week in front of us with the UNGA, I want to urge each and every one of you to bring the insights, the solutions, and the connections that you made today. Bring them with you and take them into the discussions that you will enter into this week. And remember the urgency, the urgency of our mission and our collective, collective responsibility to rescue those SDGs. This is our moment. Be the champions of digital solutions and be the architects of a more inclusive, of a safer, and a more sustainable world, both online and offline. Thank you very much.